Hey, what's up guys? Sam from Cubi Studios here, back to finish, hopefully, this part. My Doom 3 Lost Mission Let's Play, which I just had to restart because I kind of made it like halfway through this uh, hell area. We're in the depths of hell now, obviously. And then I had to like restart because I forgot I left my air conditioning on for the whole recording. And so now it's later in the day, but I still want to really get this video out. So it's like dark halfway on my webcam, kind of. I need to get proper lighting for my Let's Plays, but I really don't know how to do it. I should really look up how to like properly light a set. But I also like am not professional to the point where like I need to have like a a lamp in front of me. I'm a small time YouTube page, so I really don't think people care all that much if some of my face is dark. You know. Maybe if I'm hitting the big like hundred thousand subscribers or something, then I might be like, okay, I need to step the game up. But for now, I'm just having fun interacting with you guys in the comments and all of that good stuff. And playing through games that I'm really bad at and everyone likes to make fun of me for. But that's okay. Because I appreciate it. And also mostly because I ran out of commentary on like... Who the fuck's shooting at me? Ah, shit. Mr. Ravenger back here or whatever. I think that's what they're called. I googled it and I totally forgot. Just after a while. Because people get really mad when I correct or incorrectly label some of the creatures in Doom. Like, uh, I called imps demons, and people got really mad. <laughs> Whoops. Sorry about that. You know. It's not, they don't, uh, Doom isn't the type of game that explains to you, this is this enemy, and this is what it's called, and here's this kind of thing about it. And that's fine. It totally works for Doom. I'm just saying, you can't get, like, super mad at me for not knowing that kind of stuff when the game doesn't tell you it. I didn't get an instruction manual. Someone texted me, and I got distracted, but I can't look at it right now, because there's zombies in my face. Oh, fuck! And flying skulls. <laughs> Damn it. Damn it. These, the flying skulls, or the lost souls, whatever the fuck they are, most annoying enemy in Doom. In Doom 3, and Doom 2, and Doom 1, fucking any Doom game you name, that's that. God. Hey, thanks. This thing again. Nothing is like, they never kill me, but they always just peck away at my health. They're like annoying little birds. They fly in and they're like, Wee -wee -wee, and they smack you. And I hate it. God, do I hate it. What? It's, someone give me a tip. Although, I guess I'm done with Doom after, uh, after the Lost Mission expansion. Because I've beaten 1 and 2 and 3 and res uh, Resurrection of Evil. Of course, I will go back and play them all on the hardest difficulty, probably, if someone can help me get the multiplayer achievements. So that way I can get all the achievements in these games, and that would be awesome. But, uh, yeah, I need tips on how to fucking deal with those guys, because while they never kill me, they always do so much damage to me. And I really feel like they shouldn't, because they're such small enemies. Oh shit, I got stuck on the wall. I know, I realized I could use the grabber to, like, grab his little, like, green fireball that does a lot of damage, and throw it back at him, but like, that's effort. I can just blow him up with rockets too, that works just as well. Let's use a super shotgun. Uh, I was thinking super shotgun, but now I'm just thinking chain gun. That sounds good. I got a lot of ammo for this chain gun, so I'm feeling using this. Hello, fiery hands dude. I hate these enemies. Still my least favorite enemy in all of Doom. Okay, didn't kill him with that whole clip. That's fine. Whatever. I'm not mad about it. Jesus, what a dive out of the way. It's one thing if I fire a rocket at him and he dives like that, but I'm firing like a rapid fire chain gun weapon at him. Or minigun, excuse me. You're not diving out of the way of that, unless you're diving behind cover, but he definitely was not. Hello. Fuck you. So, a lot of the times in hell, well, I guess a lot of the times in Doom in general, really. You need to kill all the enemies to advance. And again, because I don't have sound on, it's all the more suspenseful on whether or not I can do that. Because they can fucking sneak up on me. Okay. I saw him shoot the wall, so that helped. So he wasn't able to just deal unjust damage to me. Just kidding. I guess I forgot to shoot his little thing. Okay, there's something else still alive, because those stairs aren't extending to me. Oh, fuck. Hiya. How you doing, buddy? Jesus. Speedrun tactics. 
Man, those mad speedrun tactics where I jumped over it as it was falling. <laughs> Hello, baby. I'm glad you fell from fucking, uh, well, maybe they are fallen angels. He fell right into the ground, like, at a high speed. I'm surprised he didn't just flatten like a pancake when he landed. Okay. Took care of those things. Those are the second most annoying enemy in all of Dune. I wonder, does the chain, does this minigun do more damage or does the plasma gun do more damage? Oh, can I, like, kite him? Or her spider thing back like this? Oh, get fucked. I absolutely can kite it like that. I thought last time I tried to fight it, because this is the second time. This is where I stopped recording last time, though, was after I killed that spider and realized I still have my air conditioning on, and I destroyed the audio quality of this video. So I reshot it, luckily, because Doom... Another thing I appreciate that old ga or newer games don't let you do anymore is save wherever the fuck you want. I appreciate that a lot. There's a lot of newer games just rely on checkpoint systems, and like, that's it, and that sucks. The rest, pause, save thing is awesome. But checkpoints and the press, pause, save thing are both better than find a save location and then save. Because then you're playing way longer than you need to be. Looking at you, Metroid Prime. I haven't played that in so long. Alright, I gotta kill all these, like, fiery walker dudes. Probably. Boop! Okay, there's probably more stuff in here. See, again, problem with no audio. Oh, hello. Found him. I was gonna say the problem with no audio, but when they're big fat guys like this, guess what? You still see him. Check out my strafing skills. Ah! Uh, oh, fuck. I was bragging about my strafing and how I dodged all those shots and then I took one right in the mouth. Oh shit, hi. He spawned right behind me. Fire too slow. Oh, I got too. Oh, now nah, I'm getting greedy. I was fucking trying to strike way too hard and I walked right into each one of those shots. That's okay, I dodged most of them and I'm still alive. That's the important thing, right? Jesus, there's three of them in this room. These are ugly looking motherfuckers, by the way. Everything else looks pretty cool, or all the bad guys look generally pretty cool. That guy, just fat and ugly. Hello, teleporter thing. I was like looking into the eye of Sauron. I assume it was a teleporter, and obviously it was, because now here I am. Fuck you. Those guys are the third most annoying enemy. So now I'm just listing enemies in ranks of annoyance. First being those uh, flying, the lost soul guys, of course. People have to agree with me on that, right? They, ca I can't be the only one that thinks that's the worst. Uh-oh. I have just my plasma gun left for aerial enemies. That's probably not good. Oof. I just had to hit him a couple times, though, and it worked. did the charm. Or did the trick. Did the charm? Fuck. What did I just say there? Oh! These guys like to get in my face randomly, apparently, now. They look nothing like their original Doom sprites. A lot of the other enemies do a good job of at least kind of looking like their original model. Those guys, like, don't at all. I mean, you know, whatever. I'm gonna run in. Shout out to the scary door. Ooh, that's the thing on the loading menu. Ah, fuck. So is that just gonna, like, impede my progress? Or am I gonna have to do some, like, platforming, dodge getting crushed by, uh, ceiling things again? Because I really hate doing that. Mostly because I'm really bad at that. I like that their death animation like has nothing to do with how I'm shooting them and they just suddenly like their legs give out and they're like, Ugh! Oof. Actually, I think if I shoot these guys with weapons, they don't do anything to me. Oh, I should probably just strafe though, because by trying to shoot, I like, as soon as I was like, I'm just gonna shoot it, I ran out of ammo and I got two cheap shots right into my face. Okay. Let's do this. Am I just about done? I feel like I'm just about done, because everyone said this was short, and I'm in hell. And hell is the end of each, like, Doom 3 part. You go to hell, and then you finish the uh, fucking business. So I imagine that's the ticket. I mean, you kind of end it all in hell, and then all, all of the Dooms, but... Oh, Jesus Christ. Is this a smashing thing, or is this a door opening? That scared me, for whatever reason. Fuck you... I wish I had my chain gun again. I actually probably have more chain gun ammo, but at this point I'm just going to use all my plasma gun. And then just switch weapons again. 
Which is probably dumb just to be wasting ammo on random enemies like this. Hey, don't open up. Keep him locked in the cell, right? That's a tribute to classic games. Fuck you. Let's use a little bit of that. I was really hoping that would kill some of these guys. Oh shit. I'm trying to save ammo with the bigger guns by using a shotgun on this dude. I don't know if that helped. Might have helped by letting this thing squash a couple of them. I wonder if that'll instantly kill me. I really don't intend to find out, but I hope not. Kill you. I don't I guess I, maybe I don't have to kill him. I probably should though. Because I didn't check if that door was locked or not. Is it? Nope. It's another saving ammo tip. Run by enemies when you don't have to kill them. Fun facts. By me. As if you played any games before. Oh, fuck, I can't use the rocket launcher yet. This dude's gonna fly in my face. Because I just instantly resort to the rocket launcher with these guys. I probably They're not that hard to kill. Especially because they're slow moving and slow shooting. So I can deal with them probably with like any weapon. But I just like to use my rocket launcher because that's what the big guns are for. Oh god, that guy's in my face. I'll kill this little guy first. And then switch to the big one. Because these guys ironically will do more damage to me. I don't think I like ever take damage from these uh... What's this about? Oh fuck you imp. That took me two rockets. I don't think I never take damage from these guys because they're so slow. It's easy to strafe out of the way. Boom. Boom. Ah, fuck. I said that and then I did damage to myself. Well, I had the rocket launcher out. I'm just going to blow him straight up. And you. Fuck you. I just didn't like the way that one looked. <laughs> I'm running low on rocket ammo now because of that, but whatever. I can chain gun him down most of the time. It looks like it doesn't even... I like that now that I don't have chain gun ammo, it doesn't randomly select the chain gun and remind me I don't have ammo in it. I just don't pick it up anymore. Or I don't rotate through it to it. Okay, where am I going now? Apparently still in here, because there's still enemies. Fuck you. Okay. Now, I'm going to go that way. Or am I leaving... Or am I on the platform I'm leaving through? Let's see. Let's use up the rest of this rocket launcher so I can just get right to the BFG when the time comes. Again, saving the BFG... Oh, fuck. I missed that last shot. But, I mean, three rockets is probably more than enough killing a couple of plasma rounds. Just like that. But yeah, still saving the BFG for the big boss. That's probably coming soon, I would imagine. Because we're in hell. I can use a shotgun on this guy if I take my sweet ass time. Oh, I have more chain gun ammo. Check me out. Rightful. <laughs> you know, because I have it equipped. It doesn't get enough love. So we'll use it a bit more. And by it doesn't get enough love, I mean I don't really use it much. Fuck you. Ah, get some. Hey, I don't like the way you're throwing fireballs at me. Rapid fire, too. Jesus. That'd be cool if you could get that ability. Like, if I could start throwing flame balls at things. If I, like, ripped one of their arms off and just started casting fireballs. That would seem Doom-esque, too. But I don't think that's been in a Doom game yet. Maybe it's been in a mod. But it hasn't been in a uh, vanilla Doom where you, like, get their weapons. Had to take a quick pause to grab some coffee because I'm, it, like, unreasonably tired right now, but... Also, by coffee, I mean cheap Starbucks bottled thing because, you know, it's easier to make and I'm broke. I'm not broke, but, ah, yeah, you know, I'm in college, so. I'm college student level of money. If you've been in college before, you probably know what that's like. Uh, kill this dude. Oh my god, I'm almost fucking dead. Uh, we're gonna straight away from this guy. Is this health? Fuck yes. I really could use some armor, though. Fuck this guy. I just realized how, like, dangerous... Oh, here we go. There's a little bit of armor for me. I, like, just realized how dangerously close to death I am. That's not good. We're gonna check this room for uh, a little bit of armor. Okay, it doesn't look like there's armor there. Dope. This is not good when you're approaching the final boss and you have fucking 40, bit, uh, 40 units of health and 15 units of armor. Is there anything in this room? What's the point of this room, then? What's in here? Okay, dope. So that's an area for enemies to spawn and nothing else. Do I open this door? Nope. This door must be the way to go, then. There we go. Couldn't the other doorway just, like, have connected me through here? Look at this guy. He looks like he's coming from that door that I entered on the other side. Fuck you. Shit. 
There's one over here, too. Oh, God. Give me health, give me health, give me health. Oh, shit. Didn't give me health. Okay. Is it overkill if I use the BFG on this dude? Yeah, probably. Uh, uh, strafe. Damn it! This game was like auto saving on me left and right for a minute there, and then once I died, it was the one time the game hadn't like auto saved in like 20 years for me, and I had to go all the way back through a bunch of shit. That sucked. Fuck you, asshole. Okay, he was like double shot in rockets. That's bullshit. They, uh, they weren't doing that for a minute. Okay. Did I come through this way? No, I didn't. Okay. My thumb hurts from the constant uh, click in for sprint. Ooh. This boat should... F uh, fuck it. It looked like there was a portal here for a second, but I guess that was the boat portaling in. Check it out. This is actually kind of cool. Oh, now we're going into hyperspeed. Maybe throw my gun away. Dun dun. Dun 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 dun. Check me out. I'm like Titanic in it right now. I'm on the edge of the abyss. Hey, how nice of it to appropriately place me on this edge. Hey, asshole. Fuck you. No, I didn't throw him far enough to go into his friend. Fuck you. That was one of my favorite things about the uh, gripper or grabber thing. I give that gun shit, but what's always really funny about it is grabbing the lost soul guys. That's really funny. Is this a portal? Is this a switch? Does this do something? Oh, okay. It's not this way. I remember I was supposed to find the rare logo for the rare game before I. Uh, do the final boss, but since I haven't seen that yet, I'm just gonna go ahead and assume I'm really not close yet. Fuck that guy. And this guy. I like that they have, like, robo-legs in the back. I like that randomly some of the demons from hell are just robotic. Like the cyber demon, who's been an iconic boss enemy in Doom since the first game. Why? Why is he cyber? I guess that's probably in the lore somewhere, and I just didn't pay attention to it. Like, those dogs have robo-legs. Those dog looking things. I really hope those aren't supposed to be the demons from uh, Dooms 1 and 2. Because that's like a horrible transition. Those demon things looked cool and like had mouths and big pink bull looking things. Those things are just fat dog looking things with robot legs. That'd be a horrible graphic transition. I just took way too much damage there. Mostly because that fire guy was at the end of the hallway. Probably could have switched to a better weapon to deal with him, but whatever. In fact, let's do that right now. Let's switch to a better weapon to deal with everything. And it looks like it might not matter the damage I took because there might be some health right here. Dope. A little bit of health, a little bit of ammo. I'll take all of that. Okay, hopefully we're closing in on the end. Because again, I wanted this to be a short series. And it's looking like it's going to be. What are these things? I thought they were pickups. I got all excited because there was a random like, green fire coming from them. Usually only collectibles are highlighted like that. They're not collectibles, because there's no collectibles in this game. I mean, like, pickups and stuff, and weapons and all that good stuff. Fuck you. Oh, God. Hello. And straight out of the way of his shot for some reason. Used up. I'm just going to use up the last four bullets. I don't care. Oh. This looks like a scary portal. Oh, well, this, I think it might just spawn enemies from here, actually. Not about that. Oh. Oh, okay. I just gotta time it so I run through this when it's not doing that. Gotcha. Okay. That's a weird puzzle, but I'll take it. Wasn't hard to figure out. Hey, spawn in. Oh. I, like, spawn camp the fuck out of every enemy in this game. Right? They spawn in and I'm just sitting there waiting for them. How much would that suck, right? You, like, enter through a doorway, and there's just a dude with a big-ass gun to your head, like, sup. Unless you're a big motherfucker, like, what the hell's behind me? Jesus, fuckers! Alright, they did more damage to me than fucking absolutely necessary, and I like that they rubbed right against my ass so I couldn't run away from this dude. They were like, ah, oh, no, you, you can't uh, strafe. 
face him like a man, even though he's three times the size of you. That was bullshit. I bet you this portal also takes me all the way back to the beginning of this, too. That would suck. I missed all those shots. I thought I, like, arced him properly for the way he was moving. There's another demon guy back there, but I wonder... Can I just, like, keep going at this point? I left some... Ah! Fuck. The OCD in me is fucking kicking in telling me not to leave that ammo behind. I don't actually have OCD, but I have that thing where, like, I like to grab everything, but then everyone on the internet likes to call that OCD. I have that kind of OCD. I acknowledge that it's not real OCD. What just hit me? I was through the door. Fuck you guys. Give me the grabber. Hey! Hey! Quit doing shit. Oh, I ran out of grabber and it still killed him at least. I thought that he was going to turn around and bite me in the face for that. How much would it suck to be a floating skull in hell and then some guy from the living mortal world grabs you with a fucking future gun and swings you around and is like, Woo! I don't care about your immortality or your damn to hellness. This looks like a boss battle if I've ever seen one. What's going on here? This is it, right? Is this not it? So no one's answering the call of me being here. This is the anticlimactic finish of like when you get to the end stage and you expect a big fight and like you get to the end of the castle, Bowser's just not there and you're like, uh, can I catch you on a bad day? What's going on here? Oh, okay. Activate teleporter sequence. I was like so confused what was happening here. I guess this isn't a boss fight. This is a hell teleporter. That doesn't make much sense to me, but I'll take it. I mean, I get that we've been teleporting in and out of hell, like, all game. Come on now. Why would hell have one that's, like... It's not even... It doesn't look like it accidentally ended up in hell itself. It looks like it was built in hell. Oh, I thought the portal, portal was hurting me for a minute, but it's definitely just that guy. Come here, fatso. I don't like you. You're dead. Teleport me. I guess maybe I'm just killing shit until that portal fully charges or something. As you do in video games, enemies spawn when you need something to happen. Running out of plasma gun. Ah, I should be fine. It's starting to get real hot in my apartment, man. Summer, the worst part about summer, or at least living on the top floor of your apartment building in the summer, is just how hot it gets. Like, this is why I couldn't live down south, man. I would be fucking dead can't do it. You're dead. Especially because uh, my Xbox 360 is playing this game. And Xbox 360 generates a lot more heat than you would ever think it generates, right? I guess I didn't even have to stand in teleporter. I guess just once I did it. Is the final boss not in hell? What? I would have expected, if anything, the final boss to be in hell, right? Well, I guess more demons are coming back with me. My thumb is starting to hurt from the weird ways I'm clicking the thumbstick. I gotta get a better grip on the controller. Oh, hello. I like when you spawn point blank. I think I missed. He did too, though. And I'm point blank, so I guess we're even. Alright, let's just fucking switch to an actual weapon. This guy's gonna kill the fuck out of me in a second. Fuck you. What was the point of bringing me back? Okay, what did you just do? I wish I could hear the dialogue. I'll hear it when I edit the video, but... That seemed pointless. Do I not have any ammo left in the chain gun? Now what? Ooh. You should probably not stand here, right? Oh, no. I should not. That looks... Okay. God. That's a thing. Is this the final boss? This looks final boss-like. 
Ah, oh, damn it. Shouldn't run without looking. I'm already real low on health. I could use help. Or health. Not help. I can do this solo. Nope, I caught that right in the mouth. I watched it hit me. I really hope there's not a specific way I'm supposed to be hitting him. Because, uh, oh. Okay, I might have died, but it did allow me to go back and find this rage symbol, so I can get that achievement. Dope. I'll leave that in. You can see me completely missing this rage thing, but don't worry. So that does confirm to me that I am at the final boss, and I can do this in three parts. This, also, that's gonna be a big fucking help, too. I appreciate all of that health. And now we're gonna go back down to this teleporter thing of doom. And get shit figured out. I learned my lesson this time is to not stand directly where the big bad guy is about to spawn. What? He just one-shot me? Did I just... I must have held the BFG for too long. Fuck! So now I've learned two lessons. Don't stand directly next to the portal. And the BFG tar charge time? Shorter than you think. By the way. Or the time to kill yourself with the BFG is definitely way shorter than you think. Oh, and this guy hitting you with a big fucking... Oh, hello. What is this guy? What is this thing? Why is he following me? Well, I get why he's following me. He wants to fucking kill me. I'm in hell and he's an evil demon. But still. Also, I jump into that every time. Did I already kill him? What? I felt like I hit him with that many BFG rounds last time. And I didn't kill him. Is that it? GG? Okay, here we go. It's getting red again. Yeah, there's no way I was GG. Round two. Step into the portal. Doom guy. That's still his name to me. They all call him Marine, but I, to me, he's still just Doom guy. I check out this dope spaceship that you never see, ever. This is here to pick up Doom guy and take him away for knowing way too much about hell and secret experiments. Oh, hello. Nice to meet you. Well, I've probably met already. And that was it. That. That was it. Okay. Uh, wow. That was an abrupt ending. I get. I mean, I guess I get that it was an expansion pack, but I didn't think is just gonna end like that but you know final boss is final boss i guess and everyone was saying it was short so i should have expected that anyway that's it you guys that's the end of this doom 3 series of lost mission hope you enjoyed this short little let's play series thing and uh see you guys around remember to share subscribe follow me on twitter and twitch all that good stuff and above all else make sure you have a wonderful day and i will see you around